Hey guys, it's up, Sticknack here with an IndieCraft special. And I'm making this special because um, the video I put up today, the tw or yesterday, the 12, 12W07B snapshot, uh, I made a joking tweet on Twitter just said that I would do a special if it got over 100 views today. And it did, of course. So, what I'm going to be doing. I'll show you guys for a start. Thank goodness we'll be underground. So in this area, right over here in this corner, I'm going to be making a automatic-ish farm for uh let's do sugar cane. I just do two rows. And then that'll do for now. Let's go up. I need to grab some dirt out. Grab some of that. A bit of water. Now we're going to set it really fast. Get that. I have a bunch of that's a chest, I think. Oh boy, it comes to rain. I'm not sure I had a bonus. Oh, no, not that expensive. Oh, I'm using the back to alpha tech pack, which is the tech pack of the week. Four in the So, a bucket of water. Torches, smooth stone. Uh, I'm oh, I'm sorry about this. These are gonna be sticky. I have sticky pieces, but I'm gonna waste all this. So this. I have a lot of cobblestone in the chest now. I don't know how big I made that farm actually. So. Just make it as many as that will make. Nine. Let's just see what the fast. I kind of want to just build this whole area down here. I wanted to make it into just kind of a farm area. Seven. So many 14 pistons. Five. So. I'm glad I didn't dig this in. Stone here. 
here. And I think I need um, some repeaters. No, no, I won't need some repeaters. Oh, I don't know. This is good. Let's see how it turns out. And then I need uh, sugar cane or sugar cane. Let's do sugar cane. Back down to the basement. Because it's sugar cane, I have to cut out all of these, I think. But then center. Here, now this is gonna work when the pistons. Um, change my mind. Oh, I usually don't work with this stuff unless I have instant mine or creative mode. I'm gonna move this all over one I, I changed my mind again. I don't want to. Basically how this is going to work is pistons are going to come up and I didn't bring enough cobblestone for this. Not good. I'm going to have a button right here and that button is going to and I think I can just run the redstone through the back here. I'm going to need to go upstairs and grab some of this stuff. I do need to repeat at least one to make a button. Where is that? Is that? That's that. Alright. Those right now. Um red some torches for the repeater. Here. I think I can just run this like this, and no, it's not going to work. Dang it. So we're going to need enough repeaters to cover this entire back wall. And there's seven pistons, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Alright, so we're going to need a lot of repeaters after all. Uh, I don't think I have the smooth stone for it, so I made to pause the video go make some more. Yep, choppiness. Some redstone and oh, really choppy. Not good. Okay. Okay. So. Oh boy, it's getting choppy. Nine more of those. And I need more space. Actually, a little bit more. Well, I need six more for the one side. And then I'll study four more. So, okay. so done. Nope, not right. Well, let's throw this in the furnace really fast. And while that's going. We'll make ourselves more redstone torches. And this is making a lot actually. Um, okay, so we're gonna do that. Actually, we're actually going something productive. I'm using a modded jar right now. That shouldn't make a huge difference, really. I'm not using any of the mods. I just had it on and I was too lazy to switch over. Okay. 
kind of want all the redstone to be hidden. on a delay tick of one because I want all the pistons to kind of go out at the same time just for dramatic effect huh? oh I went over I know there's only seven spots there didn't actually Need to tear that row out. Like that. All right. Cover all that up. And one, two. So that didn't make it to the end pistons, did it? Okay. Didn't think it actually would. All right. So that's. One, two, three, plus seven, ten, four, five, six. Oh, oh, I just drew it. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. Repeater there. Probably still won't be enough. Oh well. <laughs> Those got so. So let's go and grab that smooth stone, and it should be done, and we can go on those repeaters. There's enough redstone on me. Oh, I just throw that junk on the floor. Thanks. Okay. Um, what was I doing? I'm losing my train of thought. Use all of it up. And this room back down the stretch. That'll be enough. I want to close it all in. Oh boy. There we go. Cool. And that'll push it all. I'm gonna actually move this water to the end there so it can build in this way. Then all we have to do, I want to close this all in, kind of. I can have those visible. That one, that won't kill me. Close all of this in here. Actually, I'm gonna leave this open just for access to the circuitry, just in case I need to come back later. on and that side's pretty hidden pretty well hidden and then actually just because this wall is all smooth oh, I don't have any supposed to I don't care that much there we go perfect they all come out the sugar beads and so we can all food farm later just like that, and then we can let it all. I'm not gonna actually push the entities into the water, so I might still walk out, but, but it looks cool. But yeah, that's all it is. That's um, if you want to know how, if you want to, if you watch this to learn how, then that is how you build a sort of automatic respawn. And that's all I got. So uh, thank you guys for watching, especially thanks for the hundred views on the other video. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.